guys, it's me, Ozmas Prime. Today we will be reviewing Transformers Titans Return Deluxe Hardhead. And here is Hardhead, looking pretty, pretty accurate to the series, that, um, Headmasters. And I gotta say, this is a good figure. Um, one of the best ones from the Titans Return Deluxe line so far. Um, my real gripe is probably the hollowness in the arms. And that's like the only gripe I have besides most of reasons. It looks like he got his arms sliced in half. Um, and the legs do have some hollowness too, which kind of buzz me also. But overall, it's not a bad figure. So, um, so let's get the comparison out of the way. Here he is compared to Transformers Deluxe Blur. See how it scales up with a another Autobot. And then here is how he scales up with Deluxe Scourge. So I really like the whole fact that the Decepticon is the tallest one. Um, Blur's pretty short. Um, Hardhead's kind of around the same height as Scourge, I think, like a hair shorter. So yeah. So accessories he does actually he comes with this gun right here. It's not actually on it's not actually made on the figure. It you can take it off. So it looks really cool. And ugh. he comes with the headmaster, of course. And he comes with this gun right here. Um, same green as his skin. I think the green's just a little bit like a shade. Like a shade, um, shade darker, shade lighter. I don't know, it's probably just me. So, um, let's, um, let's look, let's all look at our articulation. So in robot mode, he has, his head is on a ball joint. His, his arm is on this ball hinge kind of thing, so you can do like a double articulation. So if you want to, it's kind of like, um, let me show you right quick. I haven't revered Blur yet, but Blur has the same exact thing. It's on a ball joint, and then a hinge. So, um, yeah. And then his, um, he has elbow movement right there. And a hand, and a hand swivel. No waist articulation, but I think Blur is like the only one at the moment that has waist articulation. Um, has movement at a ball joint up here. Has a swivel at the thigh. Has a knee bend. Same on the other leg. So yeah, that's all the articulation that you get. Really good figure, actually, I think, at the moment. Probably the best Titan Return figure. That's the Deluxe. And let's get the transformation. So when you go to transform him first, you want to get rid of the gun. Sorry about that. And then, um, you want to, um, next remove the Headmaster. Then after that, you want to fold in the hands. And then you want to push up the arms like this. Ugh. Then you want to fold this gun back, which is not really a step, I don't think, in the actual book. And then you want to widen them out like this. You want to then put the arms way out here. And uh, just keep them right there. Then you want to move this whole back section here. And you want to actually get the legs in. Um, I think the legs are supposed to peg in a certain way. I don't know. So, um, the back here, I don't think peg in, pegs in. Oh, yes, there's a little peg. Then with the legs, you just want to... Sorry if you can't see that. You can want, you want to move that into that slot. Same with this leg. You want to move that into its slot. In there. Oh, I think I messed up on a part. So first, you first. Sorry, I I messed up. So first, what you want to do is you want to fold the feet down, then push it into the slot. Do the same thing with this leg. Then push it into the slot. And now you want to push this down. And now you want to push these back in place. You, we are almost done here. Next, you want to get the little minicon. I mean, the headmaster, and you want to transform him, which is very easy. And now you want to open this right here. The headmaster will fit 
in pretty securely. And you are done. Now with the other weapon, um, with this, I don't really like do anything with it because it doesn't really look that cool up here. Uh, yeah, no, it doesn't look cool. Oh yeah, but a really cool thing about it though, if you put it like this, first if you want to open up this, place the gun there. And you want to get your mini con out. Um, you want to move this gun to the side. You can totally get your mini con riding hard hardhead. So for comparison, let's get this gun out of the way. Here he is compared to Tag Returns Blur. As I can see, it. you can see Blur's face. Ah! Blur was never a headmaster, so here he is with um Scourge. So the conclusion. Should you buy this figure? Yes! The best Titan Returns Deluxe class so far, in my opinion. I'm him and Blur are kind of on the same level for me. You know, I just really like the character. And, um, so yeah. I hope you enjoyed this short video. Remember, game, not game today, review today, I guess. Prime out.